I forgot to mention, I put a clear coat on all these things yesterday so they won't rust inside out filled clear coats. It's off gassing fairly bad, so I don't think any critter is going to come and eat those things for a while. Um, so I'll give it a few days, maybe a week or so, once the clear coat wears off. Should be good. So you can kind of see the view from the very bottom. And we'll get a view from the second floor later. So I came up here, set some Christmas ornaments. Got So we got a, a diver with peanut in it. Also, we got a ring bell hook on the tree and the second you hit that, this thing, it's gonna ring. It's gonna really cool like a gong. And I set a truck right here with a peanut behind it and I just realized there's a previous squirrel I killed that dragged it out of the hole. It's kinda cool. Kinda disgusting but it's kinda cool. And there's a hole right here on the rat around there's another truck right here with peanut in it here's a village with a peanut and also there's another truck with a peanut in it should be a pretty good shooting gallery so we got this location that location that and the yellow truck and the diver's helmet and the ring up there one two three four five five locations and with the target existing yeah let's go back to see the squirrel again look at that squirrel it's insane so dried i guess it went in there before it died and got dragged out by some other critters and that's where we're gonna shoot from. You have to jump up there and do all that with a leaf blower, so it's easy. I can get rid of all the, all the dirty stuff. Hey guys, so this is the new setup. We have one, two, three, four, five, and six. So this piece, you hit the bottom plate, it should ring pretty good. Okay? And we have a center knife man diver helmet with peanut in it. Okay? You can tell I already shot one shot right through it to the back of the helmet. So it's a pretty good bullseye. And we have a red truck with a peanut in it and in the bed of the truck. And we have a yellow truck with a known rat hole. And here's a dead squirrel that was killed. The squirrel was killed and went into the hole and somehow the new occupant in it has basically dragged this squirrel out of the hole and leave it to dry. Very interesting. So later on when we get the night vision we should be able to see what kind of occupant it is in there. And of course we have some peanuts. See the peanuts? And in the bed of the truck there's peanuts in it for the occupant of that hole. And I believe that it's also a rat it's a carcass from previous, previously shot. And we'll move over. Here is my Winter is Coming Gang of Throne 
uh, Jello making village. And it's just a tiny village with a bunch of peanuts scattered all over it. I'm trying to see if I can see the peanut. Okay. So it's going to be fun when I in it. And I just took a shot into this thing. And instantly the shape went back. So you won't even tell where the hole is. So that's going to be a really, really fun target. And obviously our new truck. New green farm truck with tons of peanut behind it. And peanut inside the the truck driver seat, passenger seat. It's gonna be very Fargo like. So cool, very cool. I'm curious what would happen if we shoot the the squirrel. So in this case, we will. I'm not sure it's a squirrel or a rat, but we'll try it. See if we can get some good hit. That was a straight punch. Let's try lower so you get more body movement. Let's try one more. Pushing the us back into the hole essentially try one more Push it back in. I think that's as good as we can do. How many more? One last round. One last round. One, two, three. Let's go hit. See if that thing got pushed out of the way tomorrow. Let's try to hit this belt. In the middle of the screen. Caught the gun. by a little bit and to the right left to the left just a tiny that was low was a direct hit put a dent in it that's good nice